about diagnostics we know that when tester as a client request the ecu which acts as a server for a service the server checks if it's possible to perform the service and if it's possible then it performs it and responds with a positive response message whose format we saw in last video link to that video is given in the description but in case when checked if server finds that it's not possible to perform the service requested due to some reason then it has to respond the tester with a negative response message in this video we shall understand the negative response message format negative response message always contains 3 bytes the first byte is negative response service identifier which is predefined as hexadecimal 7f irrespective of what service is requested by the client if server cannot perform it the negative response always starts with hexadecimal 7f the second byte is a service id of the service which cannot be performed same as as id present in the service message and the final byte is a negative response code as we know negative response is being sent due to server not being able to perform the service requested due to some reason there can be various reasons for the server to not perform the requested service the requested message format may be wrong the current working conditions of the server may not be suitable there may be various security reasons and so on so in the negative response message the server mentions a code called as negative response code or nrc which indicates the reason for not performing the requested service uds predefined different negative response codes for various reasons under which the server can reject the request to perform a service the list of various nrcs described in uds protocol are given in a website whose link is present in the description this is a format of negative response message in uds protocol